It is mentioned in the Hadith that after the descent of Prophet Adam to the earth and his lamentation, God taught him words and introduced people to him, whom he introduced as the causes of the creation of the universe. فَتَلَقَّى آدَمُ مِنْ رَبِّهِ كَلِمَاتٍ فَتَابَ عَلَيْهِ Then Adam received certain words from his Lord, and he turned to him clemently. So Adam learned some words from Allah and used those words as a means of his repentance. Regarding this verse, there are hadiths that are very wonderful. And according to the said verse and these traditions, a person can understand well that Fatima is Zahra is the cause of creation. That is, just as the Holy Prophet, Commander of the Faithful, and Hasnain are the cause of creation, Fatima is also one of the causes of creation. And it is not reasonable for someone to be the cause of creation and not have guardianship. In this regard, Ibn al-Abbas says in a hadith, When the angels prostrated to Adam, arrogance entered him, and while boasting about himself, he said, Lord, have you created a creature that is more beloved to you than me? And he repeated this question three times, and it remained unanswered all three times. The third time when Adam repeated his question, he realized that his unanswered question was not a word. Then he was addressed from the Lord. Yes, O Adam, I have creatures more beloved than you, and if they had not come into existence, I would not have created you. He said, Lord, show them to me. At that time, it was revealed to the angels of the divine door from the Almighty God, pull aside the curtains. When the veils were removed, five spiritual characters appeared from behind the curtain of the unseen, standing in front of the throne. Adam said, Lord, who are they? It was addressed, This is my prophet. This is Ali, Amir al-Mu'minin, his cousin. This is Fatima, his daughter. And these two, Hassan and Hussein, the sons of Ali, are the children of my prophet. And after introducing their names, God said, O oh, Adam, these people have the first rank, and their rank is very high, and your rank is next to their rank. And later, when Adam committed and suffered from that first desertion, he said, Lord, I ask you to forgive me for the sake of Muhammad, Ali, Fatima, Hassan, and Hussein. So his prayer was answered, and he was subject to God's pardon and forgiveness. And this is the meaning of the honorable verse that God says, So Adam. So Adam learned words from his Lord, through which his words of repentance were accepted. <laughs>